I need rocket debris. That was very loud, just so you know. It kind of scared me. Thank you for that link you just sent me. Holy. That was terrifying. Nightwolf, what's going on? Welcome in. Thanks for the follows, y'all. Welcome, welcome. Armor Nick, are you going to fill him up? Maybe. I'm here for it, buddy. <laughs> Uh, guys, thanks for all the follows. Welcome in, everybody. Hope everybody's having a great Saturday. Welcome, welcome. I think we have a cluster going on right now. Cluster, cluster <laughs> F word. I'm just saying. Uh, Black Hat, thanks for the biddies, bro. Appreciate you. Oh, my goodness. It is going. The Uber driver's getting a little, a little goofy right now, but here we go. And I'm full, by the way. Resort. I didn't realize that. That's okay though. We're making it happen, chat. We're making this happen. Good thing Sarge is here too, huh? Well, Sarge is about to get run over. <laughs> so maybe Uber drivers and uh, forage harvesting's not the strat. That's what I'm kind of thinking. Maybe actually, you know. That's okay. We're making do, chat. Making do. We're keeping two harvesters moving sometimes, you know? <laughs> Most of the time. Yeah, more than not. I say that and Cody's over there not moving. Because <laughs> he's full. <laughs> uh, Nightwolf, sorry to hear you're sad. That's unfortunate. Hopefully things get better for you. Uh, Dave, if you're wanting to join us, come in our team so we can get to know us, bro. Thank you, Bert. Come in our team so we can get to know us off stream. And then you, you know, might hit the mods and stuff and your computer might not like the map. So you might not be able to join, unfortunately. Totally didn't just happen recently to somebody, I swear. Not at all. Totally did. But I guess stuff happens. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, hey, our next map. I already have our next map in mind. Just, just so everybody's aware. Totally know the next map I want to play. Regular size map. Same. Uh, Power of Slime, I Next time we forge harvest this field, I think a north-south midway pass is a great idea. Uh, we're a little far into it now, but yeah, next time a north-south pass would be a great idea. And then harvest it east-west, but basically have a north-south to open the field up for the for the tippers. Absolutely. Uh, we'll do that next time. For sure. Or maybe even two. Yeah, two of them. TeamSpeak, that's still around. Yes, I know. I'm the old man on the internet. I use TeamSpeak. I know. I know. But it's a good time. It, it helps keep some of the trolls out. I, it's a habit thing for me at this point. Um, I like TeamSpeak. Been using TeamSpeak forever, so uh, we're going to continue to use it. We also have a Discord, exclamation point Discord in the chat, but we don't really like hang out and talk in there. Uh, that's what we use TeamSpeak for the Hangouts. Big underscore R underscore farm just subscribed. Big R Farms, thanks for the uh, brand new subscription. Welcome to the Plow Team and, uh, and uh, enjoy your chat badge and your emotes. Holy cow. Easy for me to say, right? Appreciate it, man. Thank you. Hope you're having a good uh, good Saturday. Holy cow. Yeah, I think next time chat, that's a great idea. We'll go like somewhere in here, go north all the way, and then come back like over here somewhere. Go like north south, north south, whatever, make one or two passes, and then harvest the whole field east west. So that like the guys don't have to right. especially when we're punching through like we just did. Which one are you going to, Nick? Uh who needs it worse? Are they both yeah. full? Heart's full on mine. It's fine, I got an Uber with me. I go to go to him. Alright. Uber. Uber. <laughs> I can say Godie's, yeah. King 716 just subscribed. 
Okay, thanks for the uh, brand new subscription. <laughs> Enjoy your chat badge and your emotes as well. Thank you so much, guys. Welcome to the plot team. Appreciate you guys. New sub hype. Let's go, chat. Gotta love it. Thanks for sugar and the hype train as well. Holy cow. Appreciate it. So appreciate it, guys. Thank you all. Welcome in. All right. Here for the new subs and the old subs and everything in between. Maybe not the cows, though. Our cows are going to give me Facebook nightmares. Facebook, Liahu who just subscribed. Uh, Facebook, thanks for subbing up as well. My goodness. Can we do gold? Uh, this map does not have gold, so no. Uh, we have, like, done stuff with gold in the past, but not on this map. This map doesn't have it. Been lurking for a while, but I appreciate you subbing up. Very kind of you guys. Appreciate y'all. Right. Why'd you gotta love it? You like get here and you're full already, right? <laughs> Spiniest Tom Hang Cattage, here. cheered X100, hype block, steam locomotive, cow, cow, yeah. <laughs> Tom Cat, thanks for the bits, dude. Appreciate you. Holy cow, guys. Oh, I said cow. Dang it. Only goats. <laughs> yeah, goaty, whatever you say, man. <laughs> uh, Black Hat, thanks for the bits. Only goats. Thunder farts, you know? Like, come on. What do we use chaff for? Uh, we are using chaff. We are putting it in fermenting silos uh, eventually, and we are fermenting it into silage. And then eventually, uh, for the for the moo moo food, making it into TMR or the moo moos to eat. I can't say the other word, you know. Uh, maybe we'll play on a Polish map. Uh, I don't know. Maybe. You never know. I do have our next map in mind. Like I said, I I really actually like, I know what map I want to play next. It's just a matter of getting this one done first. I definitely don't think we're done with this map yet. There's, there's still uh, there's still land to purchase. Actually, a lot of land to purchase. Um, Some big plots of land up here, 88 and 84. And really like fields... Plot 69, field 40, that's actually a huge field. So there's definitely a lot of land to purchase yet. Uh, the next thing I think we're going to be working towards now that we have our North Farm running and the, the Moo Moo's up there, which apparently there's like a million liters of milk already and there's probably actually more by now. Um, tomorrow I'm going to work on automating that off stream. But the next thing is going to be pigs. And I'm thinking this plot of land right here, plot 77, is where we're going to set up for having uh, some pigs. So it should be a good time, and I've been full apparently for a while. I need to stop. Oops. <laughs> Is there any better way? Uh, there are mods out there to help you with that, yes. Wow. We actually have to wait for a truck to get back. Are we really, Sarge? It's, it's almost back there, how Serge. Many, how many trucks do we have running? We have three trucks and we're having to wait. Oh my goodness. Hey, he's pulling around here. Unacceptable. I need more. <laughs> Unacceptable. Uh, 32. Go. Oh. Yeah, another shark in, inbound. Um, there are mods, like I said, to help with the, the, the pick it up and stuff. Uh, we haven't been able to get this one to work in a while. Uh, wait, where's it at? It's in the mod hub. I don't remember where it's at in the game. Hold on. It's here somewhere. This thing here. This is in the mod hub. It doesn't work right now as far as I know. Last time we tried it, it wouldn't work for us. But when this works, this is great. Uh, I believe you can also go to the Papa Smurf website, possibly. Somebody might have to correct me if I'm wrong. Um, the milling machines. I want to say they're on the Papa Smurf website, but I'm not 100% sure on that. But yeah. 
Why can't we say the actual word for the Moomoos? Because every time I say the actual word for Moomoos, uh, Mary posts an emote that um, distracts me. So that's why I can't say the actual word for Moomoos. Because it distracts me. Okay, Plugger, thank you. Uh, guys, if you want the Million Machine, it's an awesome, awesome, awesome mod uh, for picking up anything. Uh, basically, uh, it's on the Papa Smurf website. Exclamation point Smurf in the chat. Well, so, Obex, we've kind of split the harvest up a little bit. Uh, we Actually, yesterday we were running both. Forge harvesting and regular harvest. And today, uh, we actually did both as well. We started with regular harvest. Oh, buddy, I was hoping you'd come back to me. I know I'm full, but like here uh so we finished up our other field earlier today the cornfield is being plowed currently by uh auto drive or course play sorry and then we're gonna finish up the chaff and we'll see what else we get into today we got lots of stuff to do we might get pigs today i don't know probably not though because we need what we really need to do is buy the pig pen and like one pig and then we can decide what we're going to feed them because they'll eat like carrots and stuff too which i'm not going to worry about that you know but yeah. You got roughly 4 million silage. 8,000. Yes. No, the million machines are fantastic mods. Just like auto drive right now. It's fantastic. Can't you tell, chat? <laughs> it's just working so well. Okay, I gotta put my pipe away to get him to leave me alone for a minute. But he just buzz off. <laughs> leave me alone. I'm just gonna circle back. Hold on. This is this is going well. Here, Sarge, I'll just I'll just empty into you real quick. Auger wagons for this are not the strat. I'm telling you. But hey. It's kind of working. <laughs> it's kind of working. This course play cost and labor. Uh, there's a setting you can turn it so it costs or not. What is our server name? Dave. I'm to be honest, man. You got to stop asking to join. I told you to come in our team speak and talk to us when we're not streaming and get to know us. I'm not going to give you the server information uh, through Steam or through through stream. And I'm not going to give you the mods. All right. You got to be patient. If you want to join us, that's great. We're always looking for more people. However, uh, there's ways to go about it. And the way to go about it is to join our team speak and get to know us when we're not streaming. Okay. That makes sense. So, like, you know, maybe tonight after stream or tomorrow, just kind of hang out. But you gotta stop asking today. You're not gonna get the mods today. You're not gonna get the server information today. That's not how it works. All right? Not how it works. Well, that went well, huh, Sarge? That was. That was yeah, worked yeah, out. That went well. <laughs> Nothing to see here, chat. All right? Nothing to see here. <laughs> oh, man. See, now he's on the correct side of me, so this should go better. If he's coming back to me, which I think he is. Oh, no. Don't get behind me. Don't do it. Don't do it, bro. All right. See, it's going to work better this time, Chad. I swear. We'll close our cover so we... There we go. See? See? Yeah, so actually, last night, uh, Obelix, the guys went and worked. Well, we actually divided and conquered. We had enough people. Three of us worked on forage harvesting, and everybody else worked on the corn, the regular corn harvest. We had 15 things moving between auto drive and, and humans uh, last night. So, yeah. <laughs> it looks like our AI is back there pouting just here a little bit, yeah. Actually, we're close to that again. Are we? 
15 things. Oh, dear goodness. I didn't open inspector. Oh, wow. Chat. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have 15 things against RG. Yeah. <laughs> we literally have 15 things. <laughs> uh, why do I have 27 frames right now? I don't know. Chat, you tell me. <laughs> oh, goodness. I think the little, uh, the little TMR guys are running. Yeah, they are. Okay. <laughs> 15 things, chat. Why is everything broken? I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm out of sedative. Additive? Oh, who are we sedating? <laughs> Simple inspector, right? I usually uh, don't open inspector because it's just too much information. Unless I'm the guy running the grain cart, I don't need to see what everybody's doing. You know? I wouldn't say that I'm slacking by not having my inspector open. I just don't... Uh, I just don't need to have it open. There's there's no reason for me to, to know what's going on. You know? Yo, Ace, what's up, dude? How you been, man? It has been a while. Welcome back. Welcome back. Skull monster, you're good. I was like, sedative, what? No, I'll uh, I'll go hit the thing once I get to that end. But yeah. Clowns. Oh, hey, there's Bert. Bert figured out team speak to chat. Look at that. Out of the liquid stuff. Yeah, I'll get it when I get back up here. Danger engaged. What's up, man? How you been? Welcome back as well. Boucher. Yeah, I just, you know, with the inspector, like, that's just, there's so much going on up there that I'm the guy driving the harvester. I don't need to know what's going on, you know? Like, I legitimately, I don't need to know what's going on. Danger engaged. I'm doing well, man. Do I use any beard products? No, Ace, I don't. I should, but I don't. I I think beard oil should would be a good thing, but I've never I've been like I don't know. I don't want to say scared to try, but I just I wouldn't know where to start, you know. <laughs> Saying thanks for the follow, appreciate you. If I'd, you're going to play with fire at all, if you use beard oil, make sure you do not put any on that day. Play with fire. Oh, really? It gets very hot very quickly. <laughs> I have burned my beard off once before, so I don't want to do it again. Just throwing it out there. It was not a fun experience, man. It smelled so bad. And that smell stays with you all day long. Uh-huh, like until I was so. able to take a shower, yeah. Yep, we were burning. Uh, we were out at, on along the telephone poles. Uh, out, at, out at the farm, like our power power poles that bring us power, and we're the last ones on the run. So we feel responsible that we should go and, like, clean up around them, you know? Can't you drink now? Sure, Bert. Why not? Barley soda time. Let's go, buddy. And uh, so we were out cleaning up this mulberry bush that had grown, and it was pretty big. And we had it piled up, and we were burning it. And I was it was like it was like 10 degrees. It was super cold. And uh, all of a sudden, man, the wind shifted a little bit and that fire blew right at me. And I was standing right by it trying to keep warm, you know. And that wind shifted, that fire came, turned right up me and just blew right up the front of me. And just the beard just turned the beard white and then it just like started falling off. And I was like, oh, no. And then, of course, the smell. Oh, God, burning hair. Just not good. It smells so bad. And... uh yeah, that I, I just kept touching my beard throughout the day and like pieces were just falling off, you know. So when I came home that night, I was like, um, I'm going to go like shave and uh, take a shower. And that's exactly what I did. 
I had to get rid of the oh the stench. Oh. So bad. So bad. But it happens, I guess, right? So I've learned. Uh stay away from fires with the beard. Not a good thing. But yeah. It definitely happens. It was not fun though. Like I said, I think the worst part was the smell the rest of the day. Because that happened like at 10 o'clock in the morning, too. And that's back when we used to be at the farm for like really long days, you know. So I think we came home at like, you know, 9 or 10 o'clock at night probably that night. It's not fun. We used to spend a lot more time at the farm back in the day when we had like our big garden and all the, all the accoutrements down there, all the stuff. We don't spend nearly as long down there now. That's okay. We got to come home and watch YouTube. Dad's a big YouTube guy now, so. He watches more YouTube than I do, I'm pretty sure, so. Yeah. Okay, now we're not waiting on trucks, right? Forgot to ask that. They're waiting to unload, though. There's literally an, a line at the unload, isn't there? Wait, what's going on here? What's wrong with this truck, Nick? This isn't full, right? No, it's empty. What's he, wait, do I have them set right? I have no idea. Let me see. I bet I, this is the one I set. He's not on the right thing. He's trying to fill up with grass. My bad. Had him on the wrong set. Well, that should work better now. Whoopsie. It happens, chat. I messed up an auger wagon last night, too. Two more trucks coming, so. Heavy additive, you understand why we use that track. Okay, listen. We were out of tractors last night. We had uh, four auger wagons running down south, two auger wagons running in this field. We were out of tractors besides like big articulated tractors. So it was either the T9 or a versatile. And the versatile has duels. So they just get in the way. Uh, you don't need to set him to chaff, not grass, because he's not filling from a bin. He's being filled by auger wagons. So it doesn't matter what he's actually set to haul. The only time it actually matters what he's set to haul is when he is picking up from a bin. So it can be chaff, it could be grass, it could be, it doesn't matter. That makes sense, chat? I, I, wow, that broke everything, didn't it, Sarge? <laughs> yeah, he'll just go dump whatever he has when he gets full. Okay, we're just gonna take over for a minute because everything's in the way, there's too much stuff here. <laughs> there's too many auger wagons, everything's broken. The system was designed for two auger wagons, not 47. <laughs> I need to move this like up the field is what I actually need to do with the whole thing. I have a wet sock now. No, I don't. Spinius Tomcat H. Cheered oh, no. Dex 100. Yeah? No? Okay. Yeah? No? Tomcat, thanks for the bits, bro. Appreciate you. Yeah, this, this system is not for this many auger wagons. <laughs> Not okay. Mike Castro 19 just resubscribed for two months. Uh, Mike, welcome back for two months. Do appreciate the resub. How you doing, man? Welcome back. Nice using your prime on me. I appreciate it, dude. So this was all boogered up because I, I set that truck wrong. That's what happened here, chat. Because I set the truck wrong, everything's broken. So my fault. But you can see how quickly everything backs up and like everything's full and Harvesters can't move because everything's full, and you know. So, once one truck or uh, once one wagon pulls up, Sarge, it'll be good. Oh, yeah. Just, yeah, wasn't gonna. Yeah. What does the blue AD icon mean? Why does that pull it up, though? Uh, just go run your. I over. probably got to move uh, this is that tractor. Down to your stops or what? 
Everything good? I'm tossing. I'm oh, too. okay, yeah. Uh, so AD is auto drive. Um, auto drive is a fantastic mod. That's how all these trucks and auger wagons are moving right now. Uh, if you look, there's like these waypoints, all those little red dots, and there's like a whole road network and stuff. Uh, there's a guy on YouTube that set up most of this. Uh, his name's the Auto Drive Guy on YouTube, and uh, it is fantastic what he has set up. He set up like literally, like I said, a whole road network on this map, and then we've added to it, or I've added to it mostly, and uh, <clears> it's really cool. Work now. You want to search? It looks like it's gonna work. Okay. Yeah. Like I said, this was actually my experimental field for putting auger dry auger, auger wagons in a field. This is the first field I did it on. And I learned that everything needs more room. I think is is really the, the strategy. So I'll probably redo this field uh, tomorrow. But yeah. Where this truck is going, I don't know. Uh, he'll figure out his life. It's okay. Oh, he's going up and around the field. Yeah, he'll, he'll he's gonna loop back down to the BGA. He'll be all right. Auger drive, auto drive. Did I say auger? It's the Midwest coming out. Sorry, Ajax. Sorry. It's like last night when I said sitting, and I totally didn't say sitting. I said another S word. <laughs> I cussed on my stream last night. <laughs> Uh, Mrs. Professor, welcome in. It's going great. How are you? <laughs> totally didn't say sitting. Oh, you no, you said curse word. Spend. Oh, got it. yeah, I I cursed, Sarge. I did. <laughs> I sure did. The way I say pumpkin. What's wrong with pumpkin? Uh, people make fun of me for that one. I don't really care. I mean, it's just, it's just who I am. You know, I can't, I mean, I could change it, but what fun is that? Larkin and hanging Christmas lights. Hey, Mike, that's okay, man. I just uh, appreciate everybody participating, you know? Uh, we went, my dad, aunt, and I drove around my town the other day. And like, it was kind of sad. The, the few, the few number of lights that we actually saw around town. It was kind of, kind of sad. I just, I don't care if people just put up like one string. I just think it's cool that people participate, you know? Warsh. Warsh. Yep. <laughs> well. Say pumpkin. At least I don't say library. I say that one sometimes if I'm really trying to turn on the twang. I'll say library. I love when I say warsh. Warsh. Wash. Yeah. Uh, for cattle, yeah, the silage is for cattle. Agree. Too many Grinches. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> well, tell her she's not from the Midwest former day. Boom. Roasted. <laughs> well, she's really not. She's from Southern Canada. <laughs> Fran for cramp. Okay. There's some Southern Canada, huh? I mean, close enough. She probably calls it a hot dish, too, doesn't she? That she does. Farmer Nick, I'm going to need you to take that ring back. Um, you know. I remember it's the guy return policy. Library? Yeah, I'm joking, Farmer Nick. It's okay. How many BGA bunkers would all this chaff fill? Uh, yes. Bunch. So the BGA bunkers, the big, uh, like in game ones, right? They roughly hold 3 million is about what we can get in there. You know, 3 million is pretty good. If you get to about 3 million, you're, you're pretty good shape, at least in my opinion. And so far, and this is all off this field. We have not chaffed anything else. We were out of chaff before we started this field. Uh, but so far, we have 6.5 million. So we're talking two plus a smidge. That's actually not that bad. But we'll use our fermenting silos uh, is what we'll do. So yeah, 6.5 mil. And well, obviously we're not done yet. So 
We've got uh On my way. We got, we got a little ways to go. The, the travel time is killing us right now. Travel time is uh is definitely killing killing us right now. Because it's so far away from our trucks. But that's okay. Alright guys, I'm gonna jump off for the night. Alright, Cody, we'll catch you later, buddy. Have a good night. Have a good day. Bye bye. Bye bye. Professor says if she calls it a hot dish, she's definitely a keeper. <sighs> Oof, I don't know about that. Armanic, <laughs> we're talking about your fiance. I know. <laughs> He's like, I don't know. <laughs> WMB six thousand. I don't know what that is. Professor, hello, by the way. Welcome to How are you? Oh, goodness me. Goodness me. All right, do we try to fill him, Sarge? What do we do here? Because he's going to mess with us on the end of the... I think we fill him up, right? We might be able to get rid of them if we're going down to one harvester. Because with Cody leaving, we're going down to one harvester. We might be able to get rid of them altogether. And just run Sergeant Parmanek on uh, Burger Wagon. I think he'll just sit there and let you unload. Hopefully. We're going to find out. Yeah. Your wife calls it hot disc. I don't know if I can be friends with Mrs. Professor now. Oh, I probably just messed up, Sarge. I are raised, you good? You're I raised good. my head or oh no, it's messing everything up. Mrs. Professor, I'm joking. You can call it whatever you want. I don't care. <laughs> oh goodness. Hey, he's fine. Good. He's gone. He's gone. So that's why you say it, Professor. Okay, it makes sense. But we all know it's casserole. Okay. A hot dish is what the casserole's in. You see, when you pull it out of the oven, it is a hot dish. Literally. Oh, goodness. I'm just playing. Y'all, I don't care what people call it, you know? Just share with me. I don't really care what you call it. How about that? Hot dish casserole. I'm here for it. Just share. That's all. Just saying. You think we can cancel a auto drive or no? A couple of them probably. Are just the yeah, because they're gonna clog everything up, get in the way of trucks and stuff. Uh, I'll here. grab that when I get up there. I can do it through the menu. Oh, okay. I'll stop that guy on the field and then as they as they come out to us I'll just stop random ones how about that that works awesome that way we know um, they're empty you only do because professor does I got you mrs. professor all good Chinese rocket debris cheered X-100. George Washington was the first president of the United States. He had trouble eating a hot dish because of his wooden teeth. Okay, Chinese rocket debris, thanks to the bits. Uh, Jackson, yeah, this auger's awesome. Yeah, bigger, bigger would be nice, but this is a... It's a great, uh, it's a great thing. We, uh, we really like it. We don't use this particular one a lot. We use it just for, uh, forge harvesting for the most part. But, uh, yeah, really, I really like it for what we're doing right now with it. Chinese rocket debris cheered Dex 100, George Washington, George Washington. Casserole is casserole is an upper class. Well, then I guess I need to call it hot dish, Professor, because I'm definitely not upper class. 
Tiny's rock to be thanks for the bits. I see what you're trying to do there. Oh, well, yeah. For the record, Chad, it's one of my brothers. It's first time. You guys don't know that. First time to my oldest brother. Tiny's rock to be same person. Same person. He's just at work. It's his work account, basically. It's a work account, a home account. It's the thing. As long as it tastes right, there you go. Exactly. I don't care what it is. Just bring it on. Brian isn't working with you, Shocky. Not surprised. Not surprised. What else is new, though, right? Definitely happens. It's all good. Sarge, I don't know if you saw, but all the bailing's done up north. I didn't notice. We do need to fertilize the grass, but actually we used those, uh, we used those tiny moors last night. I don't know if I'm sold on those, to be honest. They, uh, they left a lot of grass, not, they didn't convert it all to hay. Astral sounds weird. Hot just sounds better. Okay. This sounds Uh, that'd be great. They say things like fire de fire instead of, you know, 44. That's the St. Louis thing. Fire de fire. It's like, what? You mean Highway 44? No, fire de fire. Like, um, okay. Appreciate it. I really know what you're trying to say, but all right, I'm here for it. But yeah. All right, so I would say we still want like two, uh, two wagons. Yeah, I agree. On auto drive, at least two, maybe three. Just now getting a couple of these. Yeah, because now I'm sitting up here uh, full. Rita, oh, all right, interesting. I just call to... it. I just call it. I can't make it because my oven's broken. Oddly enough, one of the tractors you stopped yep. actually had a fair load on it. Did it really? That's I don't know more, but. Copperman, why would you say that? Why would you say that? When are we going to buy the last two field, uh, big fields up north? Uh, I don't know. Copperman, why? Please explain yourself. Because you're about to get a, you're about to get a permanent. You know what I'm saying? I don't understand where that comment came from. Please explain yourself. I'm not gonna lie. Would appreciate it. You've been a good part of chat. I don't know where that comes from. You know? My Weird. tractor? No, not my tractor. I don't know. All right. Well, if you have no explanation for that, then I have no explanation for this. All right. Uh, I don't know, man. Uh, it's really left field. But all right. Uh, break out the hammers, Chad. I don't know why he said what he said, but just got to get him banned. So I was... Uh, He's been a good part of chat too. I don't, I don't feel free to put in an unbanned request. Feel free to like, think about it too, or you do, but, uh, I don't know about that one. Not going to lie. That's kind of weird. I thought I banned him. Did I not ban him? Bert, ban him. Thank you. Todd, appreciate it. Trying to be funny. This is a copperman. You know this is a family-friendly channel, right? <laughs> You've never seen Farmson Twenty Two have this many viewers, Jackson. Well, welcome to Poobal Plow. We uh, we do things a little different around here, you know. 
He thought it was a typo, didn't I know, right? He's been a good part of this chat. It's been like fine and well he's gone now, so <sighs> Like I said, Copperman, feel free to put your unbanned request in, but uh, you better choose your words carefully because it's probably not gonna happen, but I just I don't understand. It's from Joe Dirt. Do you think that line's family? That's not family friendly. Not at all. Not at all. No, he's gone. It, it is what it is. Anyway, moving on. Uh, chat. We're chaffing. That's what we're doing, you know? So confused. But alright. It wasn't in reference to anything, Chinese Racket Debris. That's the thing. If we were talking about, like, movie quotes, and then he said it, and he said, oh, it's a quote from Joe Dirt, I'd be like, all right, that's kind of funny. But, like, not really appropriate, but I wouldn't have banned him. Family friendly. It was a slip-up, okay? Last night. Okay, Jerbs. I got you, man. All good, bro. Uh, last night, I might have said, hey, chat, last night... I, I told I told I I sent Mary the uh, the clip of the lightning. Who remembers the lightning? Remember the lightning chat when I uh, when I accidentally dropped a big f bomb on stream. Yeah, I remember it. You and I were talking when it happened. <laughs> we were. <laughs> it was so bad. Oh man, yeah, I dropped the big old f bomb. Remember that chat? That was great. For, I agree with you. Yeah. Uh, so that clip is actually, it's on my TikTok, guys. Uh, for the record, there's all the socials. It's on my TikTok. Yeah. It, uh, man, that one. Whew. That was that uh, not a Taylor's Hawks Bay whatever map where they took the four maps and put them together. Remember that? And we made the whole top right like one field. And we were seeding with a Borgo is what we were doing. Oh, I about fell out of my chair that day. That was terrifying. That's all I know. Absolutely terrifying. It was funny, though. Holy. I'll do it for you guys. Just one, one little beep. <laughs> it was hilarious. Uh, in that clip, that was definitely not one little beep worth. <laughs> <laughs> no. and you know the, what what didn't translate in that clip of course because y'all didn't know and i didn't know about it at the time oh yeah i'm full thanks bert um dad was in the house and had a bowl of yogurt and i'm pretty sure he dropped it or almost dropped it i'm pretty sure he dropped it but like it was hilarious that's all i know yeah, it was a big boom and then also what y'all don't know from that clip is carson got on like the weather app right away and sent me a screenshot of where the lightning actually struck. And it was really close to my house. <laughs> we'll just say that much. Funny as in the end of it. Yeah, I mean, no, nothing got damaged. I ended stream and unplugged my PCs right away. We were, we were fine. But, uh, yeah. Ooh. Baseball. And coach, that sounds like an awesome game to watch. Not really into, I, I watch a little bit of the NFL. I don't really watch any college football because I'm always streaming on Saturdays, so. Yeah. You can't find it, got so many good TikToks. Uh, I believe the thumbnail is like a Borgo cedar, a big cedar with like a white tank on the back. And then uh, there's actually two of them next to each other. And the, the one, the second one has like more context to it. Uh, you got to scroll down kind of far though, I believe. It's, it's back pretty, uh, pretty far down there. It's like before, if you see Christmas lights, it's like before that. Uh, the fields in front of me, it has like lime on it. So it's a real white field in front of like the cedar that you see. Uh, but it's the first one of those. If you see SnowRunner, it's just above that. It's next to a Fortnite clip, actually. What is the Fortnite clip? Hold on. What was I? Oh, just where we got some Vic Royales. Okay. 
we, we were celebrating our wins, chat. Let's put it that way. Celebrating our dubs, yo. Right, I think Chinese rocking the refounder for you guys. For the record. Oh, yeah. You have me on the big screen TV and watching the game on the iPad. No, flip it the other way. Watch the game on the TV. Let's go. Wow. <laughs> uh, you missed. You know what, Mrs. Professor? I think SnowRunner. I would like to at least try the new, like, the newest update in SnowRunner. Uh, the multiplayer issues are so frustrating in that game. Oh, yeah. I always, if there's lightning in the area, I unplug my PC. I don't even, I don't mess with it. You found it. Yeah, I don't, I don't mess with lightning storms. I, I unplug. Just saying. I'm ending my stream. Bye. I, I did too. I muted TeamSpeak, literally said, I'm out of here. I'll catch y'all later. Bye. And ended my stream. As soon as like the, the video was safe, the file like was recorded basically unplugged pcs mile high sparky just resubscribed uh, for two months sparky welcome back for two months on your resub there i do appreciate it. how you doing today welcome in you like the little hand wave yeah it was the thing yeah mrs professor i think they need to like recode the entire game honestly to make mp better uh, Snowrunner has so much potential, but the, the MP issues just are so frustrating that uh, it makes me just not want to play the game, honestly. Yeah, I love Snowrunner, though. I really do. It's such a fun game. But the MP is awful. Like, I, I would pay for a server for that game if that's what it took to make MP better, you know? Like, I would totally do that. But not an option. Yeah, military police, that's what we're talking about, yeah. Multiplayer? <laughs> uh, the game SnowRunner's multiplayer is, like, just awful, so. Yeah, but the, the, the game is so much better in multiplayer, but the multiplayer is, like, awful. If that makes any sense at all. I'm cat that looks awful in Discord, by the way. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I I really like the game in multiplayer, but the multiplayer issues that the game has makes it almost unplayable. It's 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 a weird one, I know. But the game is so much better with friends. So much better. Just saying. So much better. But I, I don't know. We might try to, uh, we might give it a shot here soon. You know, why not? Like I'm all for uh, playing a whole bunch of random stuff here soon. You know, we've been playing just farm sim for a while, which has been fun. It's been great. Don't get me wrong. But eventually, uh, we are going to branch out and start playing some other stuff. I think after Christmas chat, we're going to be uh, starting up a rust server again. Maybe we'll bring in the new year playing some rust i don't know but after christmas at some point i wouldn't mind actually starting a minecraft server up again i talked about that a little bit um i don't know i'm just down to play a bunch of random stuff again you know the whole thing about playing all the farm sim has been you know during christmas lights i can you know go work on that during the day and come in here and like farm sim is a game i don't have to think to play you know uh, but a bunch of other games, it's like, got to turn the brain on, you know? Down for some Minecraft? Nice. I think Mary is too, yeah. I was hot, Tomcat. You know it, buddy. So, the, uh, well, yeah, after Christmas, though, for, for Rust. Because Rust is one of those that I'm, like, really invested in for, like, two weeks. And then I'm pretty much done. Uh, but my brother's coming to town for Christmas. So I know I'm going to be, like, away from the computer at least some while he's here, so. Yeah. What does it mean to disable the straw swath? Uh, basically, 
If you disable your straw swath, the combine will chop up your straw and, and spread it out over the field. If you have straw swath turned on, that means you get the pile of straw behind your combine that you can pick up. You could sell, you could bale, you could feed it for your cows, use it for bedding, all kinds of stuff. World of Warships, uh, that could be a fun one to get back into at some point. Those nights where we did like everybody versus me, that was kind of fun. I mean, of course I would die instantly, but it was, it was still fun, you know? It was still a good time. Yeah, basically doesn't dump straw behind you. Yep. So, yep, there's ways you can go about that. If you want straw, you need straw for your cows or... Dang it, I said, I said it. Uh, if you need, if you need straw for stuff, uh, if you don't need straw for stuff, if you don't want to take the time to pick up the straw, because it can take some time, just chop it. You know? Just chop it. Professor still plays warships. Nice. That's another. I'm I'm very and you you all probably know this. Those of you that have been watching me for a while, I'm kind of like. I get into like streaks with my games where it's like all I want to play is Captain of Industry, and then I go play something else after a while. You know, or Automation Empire. When I get into Automation Empire, that's all I want to play. And World of Warships was like that for a little bit there. I, I got really into it, wanted to play it a whole bunch, and then I just kind of went, all right, I'm done. Go play something else. Want to know what would slap? What? A hand? I don't know. But yeah, I, I'm definitely that way when it comes to video games. Or like when I got into, uh, what's that game called? Uh, Transport Fever. Remember when I was into that back in the day streams? That was fun. But I like I haven't touched that game in probably a year now. Pastrami and kettle cooked chips. Dude, kettle chips are so good. Just saying, I'm here for kettle chips. All right. That was it was fun. It was a fun game. Yeah. Apparently they've changed it a lot, Mrs. Professor. Trent was telling me. Uh, about it the other day like your towns like they change what products they need in the time you're playing the game so like it might might start out as fuel and i don't know whatever random thing and then it'll just change so you got to be constantly like evolving your supply chain i guess i don't know good evening all is all is well here yes all is well. Guys, I'm out of additive again, by the way. I just noticed that. All the way over there. I'll go get it on my next... Uh, it's only a 10% yield uh, hit if I don't have it, so... We'll get it on our next pass, guys. I'm telling you, I'm going to look for a forge harvester that has capacity. For, for uh, additive. I don't care about for chaff. I want additive capacity. That's what I want, chat. All right, we're gonna hit the end of the field here and we're gonna put our pipe away so buddy will leave us alone. Just saying. Yeah. Is so many wise are any? You did actually, yeah. Uh, I think I pay attention though, chat. Come on. I tried to. No, I definitely miss Professor, yeah. Seems uh seems interesting. That's for sure. Alright. Keeping Nick guessing over here where I'm going. See that chat? Oh goodness. I, I was actually trying to get that one piece of corn you missed. Oh, were you? Yeah, I missed it at the first get go, I turned around to go get and I got uh... the second go around. Gotcha. Yeah, because it's uh, true, Mr. Professor, especially because, like, in that game, you you cover such a time, like, such a period of time that it definitely makes sense they change what they need, yeah. Which makes me sad because I always set up fuel and that's how I make all my money, so. <laughs> what is that? What game is that? I'm Googling. 
This looks interesting. Steam page, hello. What is this? Interesting. I'm 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 watching a trailer right now. Mill for oil. Oh. Interesting. I've never heard of it. Perm oil? Perm oil. It's like a it's that's interesting. Perm oil. That is an interesting looking game. I don't know that I would play it, but it looks uh looks interesting. Well You found me on YouTube playing SnowRunner? Oh my goodness. I'm sorry. I appreciate you sticking around even though we don't really play SnowRunner anymore. Just saying. We appreciate that. But yeah. Turmoil. Alright. Interesting. Because you know, Chad, if I didn't listen to your all's... Uh... Oh, 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 okay. Uh, if I never listened to you guys about like different games and stuff, I never would have found Railroads Online. That came from chat. <laughs> I still don't know who was like, hey, have you ever seen this game? I don't remember who that was. Uh, but they, glad they said something because awesome game. Awesome game. Actually, that's another one I wouldn't mind starting back up either, chat. Uh, we'd have to play the uh, like the beta of it so we could use the new uh, track lane system. But it's awesome. That game definitely still has a long, a long way to go in its development. But they've definitely uh, changed the game a lot for the better. The track lane alone is just fantastic, honestly. The track lane is so good. Yeah. Archie just has a thing to bully you, I think. <laughs> gotcha. All good. <laughs> Actually, I should probably do this and... Oh, no, he's not going to... I was going to say fill you up because you're fuller, but... Oh, good. What a bully. That Uber driver, man, I tell you what. He is something else, right? New oh, I didn't know the new track lane was on the new branch. Okay, I haven't been checking out their uh, patch notes lately. Duckler, what's going on, man? How you doing? Uh, the new so I a while back I started a new a new save on there on the beta on Railroads Online, and it was like a Sunday or Wednesday night or something when I wasn't streaming or Tuesday or th I don't know it was some night I wasn't streaming, and it was sometime over the summer. But anyway, I went on there and I laid out like the whole train yard around the freight depot and stuff in one night. Because it's so much easier to lay track in that game now. And I had this awesome train yard. I didn't even put a train on it. Because I didn't have any money. All I had was Betsy. And I never even moved Betsy. I just went in and laid track for like... For like ever. Doc Lair, I'm sorry you have a headache. Feel better soon, man. It was great, though. It was just before 22 launch. I made you download Twitch. I'm sorry. Uh, Ajax, go get some food, bro. We'll find a, we'll find a Snickers bar or something. You're not you when you're hungry. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, you don't want to eat so you can eat more later when you go. Okay. I got you. All right. All good. All right. I got to go we'll find some additive. Hopefully it's here somewhere, right? Gonna put that pipe away, otherwise that guy's gonna come bully everything. Just saying. That's alright. Oh, Cody left his heart of harvester in a really awkward spot. And it was running. Pipe out too. 
Well, at least it's full of additive, right? <laughs> at least it's full. I get so close to make this work. Come on. Not working. Gonna get it, Chad, I swear. There we go. See? We got it. Yeah, Jackson, I'm gonna have to find one, man. Right now, this is an in-game harvester, and uh, with this big header on here, it just chews through the additive. Yeah. Uh, brilliant. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. I do appreciate it, bro. Blame Dan. There you go. I'm here for it. Blame Dan. <laughs> Poor guy's not even like, you know, around. And he's still getting blamed for stuff. He has a whole emote and everything. Oh, no. Hold on. We can't do that. They have left one little, one little stalk. Can't do it yet. That one stock's going to make a big difference, you know? Our total number or something not really not at all but that's okay every stock matters chap that's a shame <laughs> oh goodness me Oh. oh oh really it's clash crash into desktop after 90 minutes that's not cool i like what's going on back there with farmer pick that's not cool. that's unfortunate well then maybe we'll wait i really want to play it again though i want to make a giant stupid spiral that we made that was that was fun when we made that our first like time up and down that spiral that was that was that was stupid fun a good time or as buggy as that game was or is like we we had so much fun on that game excited and then we had that like third party thing where you could like control stuff from like a web browser that was really cool that night we had like or a couple nights there we had trent he was our uh like our switch man and then he would run brakes for us too on like our back cars and stuff that was really cool that was really cool uh we're using the demco uh in-game demco auger wagons uh for the ais and and farmer nick and sarge we have like six of them now I believe so. Yeah, like that. It's a bunch. Yes, it did, Wyoming Cowboy. That is called auto drive for you. They get, they, you know, when auto drive wakes up in the morning, they choose violence, okay? That's really what it is. Auto drive wakes up and says, I choose violence today. And there's, you know, if we want to use them, there's not much we can do than just to, to deal with their violence from time to time, you know? And we're currently using uh, for auger wagon help because it's not the, the guy, the two, two guys can't keep up with me. Uh, the runtime is what's killing them going from here down to where the, uh, where the trucks are. So maybe, maybe when I redo this auger wagon thing, I'll move the trucks farther north and I'm more into the, to the elbow of the field here. Like just, just below that. So that'll help. Get the trucks up farther north. That would be nice, actually. Yeah. Almost got yourself a PC when I got real. <laughs> well. 
Get out of the way or get run over. Exactly. Uh, English, please, in chat. I don't know what you're saying. I'm assuming you're saying hi or something, but uh, I don't. I don't know what that means. If you could keep it English, we would appreciate it. Just saying. Because I don't know what that means. I barely speak English, so, you know. Need all the help I can get. Just saying. It is my first language, but, you know. It's a, it's a modified, like, you know, Midwest redneck. You know, is what I speak. So, yeah. Our Spanish, Spanish, Mary can translate. There you go. <laughs> Definitely. I don't speak good or English. I didn't spend enough time at the library. That's my problem. Not enough time at the library. Speak English? Yes. Apparently at best. Was Ukrainian for healthy? No. Oh, you did said healthy and then like the hey guys? Okay. Interesting. All right. But you, never, you just never know sometimes, you know? Never know, chat. I think I'm going to turn around and take another pass. First bot. Yeah, bot. Lost it. Yeah, go talk to Sean. Armor Nick, are you driving like an AI? Yeah, I felt like it. Okay. I'm going to go back and take another pass here because, like, yeah. All right. Uh, Sean, it is break time, buddy. You're right. You're definitely right. It is. It is break time, actually. Three o'clock on the nose. But we're so close to being done, you know? We're so close to being done. I think we'll just, uh, we'll wait for, uh, for being done with this field. What's wrong? No, nothing's wrong with Boston. I just the accent's great. I'm here for it. Hot cod, Harvard yard. Sean's from uh, Sean's from Maine. He has quite the accent, and there's nothing wrong with. It. I'm not picking on accents, okay? That would be like me calling the you know the pot calling the kettle black over here. I have definitely an accent. I know I do, but uh, I'm, I like accents. I think they're funny. I think they're great. Some like British and stuff though. I can't understand for nothing. You know, I can't understand some of them at all, but I, I'm, I'm here for it from New Hampshire. Gotcha. I'm not picking on accents. That's for sure. I'm back. Welcome back. Trent. How's it going? Being all in. That's uh, good. Need some corn chips. End of the year. Uh... Oh, like a little party or something. Tommy and yeah, this little house exactly. Yeah, the, all those guys are from up there. Wait, Mary, you do? But why do you say Fortnite like a British person? <laughs> Fortnite? 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 <laughs> it's not hilarious, I swear, chat. I'm saying. Oh, not. It's funny. <laughs> oh, but that's okay. It's all good. Just casually gonna like, you know, drive randomly over here. Don't mind me, chat. Because, you know, if I don't take a full header, then they're not filled up as fast. And Messes with the flow of everything, right? Something like that. Oh, nice. See, these are those darn point rows, chat, that I talk about all the time. Darn point rows. 
but technically with a forage harvester it doesn't matter because you can like you know harvest any way you want i believe i've only ever seen one like real forage harvester it was a john deere and it was this past summer over at the uh the renner renner stock farms the 100 years of horsepower farm show way uh dad and i went to that was so much fun I know I did a, like a really bad job of like documenting or sharing that with you all. Like I didn't, I did some Instagramming and that was pretty much it. Like I have a few pictures and videos that you guys haven't seen, but I just enjoyed the day. You know, I kind of decided that day I wasn't going to like live through a lens. I wanted to like live it, you know, and it was so much fun. Oh. Oh, else that's funny <laughs> auto mod didn't like it but that's funny oh man that is amazing got here from storm and driving like auto mod or like autobot again like auto something boy yeah look out here he comes that's not me oh that's not oh i'm at i was unloading Oh, it's Trent. Sounds like I need to take a... Well, you know what? Uh, Big Tractor Power was there, and he has some great videos from that day, so. Duck Larry, feel better. We'll catch you later, man. All right, look out. I'm going to turn around. Let's turn around, Trent. Let me turn around, please. Man, he's really getting into that role of being an AI driver. <laughs> Uh, Trent, get out of my way. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> well, you guys are out of my way now. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh, oh. You have a question for Farmer Nick that you need answered. Um, shoot, I can't promise that he'll answer it, but go ahead. We use. I don't know what that is. He doesn't have any 19 mil. He has some big videos, though. He really does. Could send it. What? Oh man, that was something. That was definitely something. Oh no, farmer. Ajax, is that the one where he was shaking his backside? Uh, probably. Hey, you know, first time actually, or Chinese Dragon Debris, I actually, my video from that day has like uh, 58,000 views now. I was pretty proud of that. I found that out the other day. Somebody left a comment on it from some language I don't understand. It, or in some language I don't understand. Yeah, why'd you tag me in a video? Are you shaking your backside, bro? I have no idea, to be honest. Not okay, buddy. So you know. I have no idea why I take you. Were you just trying to? He he was clout chasing chat. I'll let him fool you. At the time in that video, I had more followers than you. Yeah, he did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he totally did. <laughs> you had like way more followers. And then Brady came in and donated twenty bucks, and then boom, I had followers on TikTok. <laughs> For those of you that don't know, there was that, that vibe. For me, it was, I mean, it's not viral by TikTok standards, but for, for me, it was crazy. 157,000 views, I believe, in like a couple days on TikTok. Yeah, it was pretty, pretty, pretty lit. All because Brady did a TTS donation and Carson put a little Sweet Home Alabama to it and bada bing, bada boom, 157,000 views. 
So, you know, there's that, right? Just opened FS19 on accident. I did that like two weeks ago. Like, far a stream. I was sitting here ready to stream and I like opened my game and went in the house to get water and I came back and farm some 19 was open and I was like, what? Whoops, wrong game. <laughs> it was kind of funny. But that's okay, it happens, right? Definitely happens. Oh, I gotta do that tonight. Chat, I uninstalled a flight sim yesterday. I'm gonna move it to an M.2 and see if it runs any better. And instead of just moving it, because that would have been the fast and the easy thing to do, I'm re-downloading it. That would have been the smart thing to do. So if you see me in a flight sim literally all night tonight on Steam, don't worry about it, okay? I'm just racking up those hours. Not really. You have to I'm be in the game. About to, it, no. You have to be in the game to download is the problem. So it take it like yeah, it's a it's a whole thing. It is definitely a whole thing, but yeah. And at this point, flight sims should be free to anyone that wants it. Just for the simple fact of all the updates you got to download. If you're willing to put the time in <laughs> to download the game, it should be free. <laughs> right? It really should. Oh, man. That's funny, actually. All right. Oh, are you asking about G portal? Is that what you're asking about? You got to put a space in there, bro. <laughs> I'm with chef. Uh, we'll check our total number here. And if you're almost done, we'll wait for a total. Uh, I don't use G portal. I'm the one uh, streamer that they've not approached and I've not approached them. Uh, everybody else and their brother uses it. Uh, but I don't. I do not use G portal. Uh, if they were to approach me for like a partner sponsorship deal, I would want to test the servers before switching to it. Um, I know what we're going to get out of our servers uh, through the company we use. We've tried multiple other companies. I I would switch if, if there was one that was better. Uh, but I, just, I haven't ever tried G Portal now. They sponsor everybody else, though, on Twitch. They don't ever talk to me. So, yeah. Hope that makes sense. I didn't know what you were out about. But I'm assuming it's G Portal, right? But yeah. If they want to talk, I would I would talk to them. But uh I would test their servers before agreeing to anything, because if it runs like crap, then I'm not gonna you know. I wouldn't partner with them if it ran ran worse than what we're on now. That's not something I would be interested in doing. So yeah. I've tried not try to, or however you say it, the one the Giants has partnered with, garbage. They switched midstream. It was so bad, we literally, Carson literally switched our save from the Natrato server back to a very game server. Midstream, one day. Yeah. It was, it, it was so bad. Natrato, or however you say it, it was so bad. So bad. There goes that sponsorship deal, huh, chat? You had free flights of 20 years ago. They had to give away, dang. That's cool. Flight Sim's awesome, and they actually, they introduced helicopters a while back. Now, I couldn't fly the helicopter the other night. I might have been a little, uh, I was participating, and then tried to fly in flight sim that was not a good idea and my joysticks were acting all weird like my Hunter. dual huh like the dual joysticks were not helping at all and i i don't i haven't plugged them since then but uh yeah i couldn't fly a helicopter i i um well helicopters aren't supposed to go upside down right i uh, guess no <laughs> so I unless you have a special one <laughs> Uh, it was upside down over Lambert St. Louis International <laughs> and, uh, it didn't end well. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. 
yeah, it's, uh, it didn't end well. We'll just put it that way, okay? It was really funny, though. I might have had some beverages in my system. I don't know. Them new, uh, them, them, uh, hard mountain dudes. They sure are good, okay? Let me just put it that way. Nice. Light sim with choppers, you can do traffic report role play. Sure. I mean, the traffic's the same on there, I think, day and night. But, yeah. I don't think there's any accidents. There is traffic, though. You can see, like, cars and stuff. Yeah. I was going to do, like, per police pursuits, you know? Be like Grand Theft Auto all over again. Somebody smuggling uh, ferrets across county lines, you know? That's a classic Puma Flap Flip, by the way. It's out there somewhere in YouTube land. Yep. We were we were doing a little RP. I guess you could call it RP. I've never really RP'd any games I play, but I guess you could call it RP in uh, GTA back in the day. It was fun. Uh, thanks for the uh, follow there. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? All right. So chat, when, I, uh, when we get this pass done here, uh, we'll get you guys a total number. And then I'm going to go take a break for just like five to seven minutes and 35 seconds okay no longer than seven minutes and 35 seconds okay uh but we're gonna take a little break and then uh, when we come back we'll uh see what else we're gonna get into we do have a actually have more harvesting to do later today uh tomorrow in game we're gonna have uh sunflowers so yeah. Chinese rocket debris cheered X100, just like a storm rolling through Macoupin County, traffic is a mess westbound on Highway 70 at Lucas and Hunt, as well as the depressed section. Oh, it's always terrible down there at the depressed section. You know it. Thanks for the bits. This shot, you can land a real fighter. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, I enjoy flight sim, but it's one of those, like, once you're up in the air and you're flying from, say, St. Louis to New York or something, it's like, okay, what do I do now? I got autopilot set. I don't, I just twiddle my thumbs. You know? Yeah, what's going on, man? How you doing? Like, the, what do you, what do you do then? So I think helicopters could be fun, but I would want to go like sightseeing with the helicopters. Like, you know, go fly around New York and actually like see stuff or go wherever and just like actually see stuff. I think it would be cool. But I don't know. I streamed the game a few times. Remember that landing chat? Who was here for that landing up in Canada? Pretty great. Ah. Stop. Stop, Troy. What's up? What's up, buddy? How you doing, bro? I am having a fantastic day. How you doing? Oh, I'm all right. Fat, full, and happy. Hey, that's a good way to live, brother. Yeah, we went to Sonny's for lunch. What's that? Sonny's barbecue. Oh, barbecue spot, huh? Yes, sir. All right. You get barbecue, or do you have like? Pizza? I got. I got smoked wings, uh, a quarter smoked chicken, and brisket. Nice. You bring me back some? Yeah. Um, actually, I did. Sharing is caring, Troy. Okay. And, uh, it might be gone by the time you get here, but yeah, I got some. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, on for about nine hours. It's gone. Oh, man. Island. ARX does not like the hills. Got your Edster. Awesome. What doesn't like hills? Yeah, ARX. Oh yeah, no. No, that's that's too much of a too much of an auger wagon for the ARX, really. Flight sim to the Everland. No, but that would be cool to go there. Uh Chinese Dragon to be. Remember that night we tried to find the Great Wall of China? Couldn't find it. He tried for hours. Like, 
legitimately there were a bunch of us ever could find it like at all we tried and tried and tried couldn't find it it was pretty amusing though all right chat let's go make sure everything is uh called in called in All right, send this truck. This should be the last of it right here, honestly, unless there's another. Oh, we are good. Okay. Look at that chat. We're not even out of the field, and there's a plow going already. See that? I'm here for it. Christmas ham on the Christmas ham on the smoker. Very nice. Uh, fast, uh, yes, probably sunflower harvest when I come back. Yeah. I'm going to get you guys a chaff total real quick and then we'll, uh, take a little break for, uh, no more than seven minutes and 38 seconds. That was 35 seconds. Well, I, I need a little more time, you know, it's going to take me an extra couple seconds, you know, I don't know, something like that. Okay, this one was set to go to one. Wait, what? This truck was set to go to side one. Oh, was it moving our Oh, dang it. Now we don't get the total. Well, it's whatever's in there, too. Oh, man. Because yeah. everything down here was empty, wasn't it? Uh, I don't know if the silo, those uh, fermenting silos were empty or not. Okay, I'm just going to take over. I can drive faster, buddy. Come on. Go, go, Gadget. Let's do it. What? And blinkers on. That's an auto drive thing, Troy. For some reason, they use their blinkers now. I don't know. They, they never used to, but now they do. Like it helps. I know, right? Don't forget the taxes on that time. What? That's a thing, right? You know, I can unload at the same time. Gotta do it right. Yeah, Mom. Um... Hopefully it goes up all the way. It probably won't, but... Oh, no, we're not doing that yet. Not using the grain door. Not having that. It's way too slow. That's how auto drive likes to. Auto drive likes to unload the slow way. Unfortunately. Chat twelve million dollars. Pretty good. Still doing okay. We had like sixteen yesterday, so made twenty off that soybean harvest. Which was pretty good. It was nice to have. Come on. Jump out. Let's go. I know I need to change my trailer one more setting, but like, it's fine. Okay. It's fine. All right, Sean, have fun. Um. What's up, Serge? Yeah, all of these got something in it. Oh, do they? That's fine. Oh. It's all good. We'll just see how much we have in storage and add a, add a million. How about that? Probably what it's going to oh, be. Oh, easily. Right? Yeah. Uh, so in storage, we have 8.6. We'll, we'll just say I bet we have like 9, almost 10 by the time. If those are like remotely full, Sarge. Not all of them. No. Okay. Because they hold like 750 or something a piece. So, a lot, chat. How about that? Final answer. They hold a lot. We have a lot of chaff. So, I'm I'm here for that. All right, chat. You know what time it is. It's time to go ride in the little car and go take a break. Be right back, guys. 